Hey guys, Party Marty here, Easy Guitar Tunes. I've got another great tune, another great blues tune. I've got another great request by one of my subscribers. Uh, the, I fell in love with it from Fats Domino there. It's called Going to Kansas City. It's been done a hundred different times. I think it was written back in the 50s, but uh, I kind of fell in love with it when I saw Fats Domino do it on YouTube. I was actually watching the video. So uh, anyway, that's kind of how I modeled it. I did simplify to try to make it another blues tune for you guys to learn on. There's a little blues link in there for the couple little tricks that I'm going to do, so hope you guys take advantage of that. Uh, basic three blues chords that I like to use are E, A, and B7. Again, E, A, and B7. A few things I do there with the E chord for starters, I, I kind of put my baby down in the second fret, second string from the, from the bottom, and then I make it a seven, so it's kind of like a slide from the second to the third fret. Kind of gives it a nice bluesy feel. I do the same thing with the A, but the A is the, the bottom string, so I go baby finger third, and then I just bend my fingers down to get that bottom string in the second, so it's like this. Also, see me take that B7 chord instead of the first fret. I'll start it in the third and slide it back to the first like this. Again, B7. All easy little simple tricks there, but once you get onto them, they do make the song sound better. I'll run into the B7, so it would just be an open second string from the top, which would be your A string, and then open, and then first fret on the A, and then second fret on the A right into your B7. So it's like this. You'll also see me do a couple of licks on the high end of the E scale and the low end of the E scale. Again, if you click on this little blues link that's in the corner, that'll give you a better explanation of all this. But quickly, the E scale would be like this. So one of the licks that I do comes on the top end of it. So it kind of it just goes like this. Click on that link, it'll give you a better explanation. And then the bottom end of the scale, I also uh, kind of almost the same thing, a little bit different, kind of goes like this. So again, click on that blues link and it'll explain those a little further for you. And uh, the only other thing I want to go over is just the strum. So it's just kind of a muted strum. I think I might have already done it in the video, but we'll do it again. Because I want it to kind of slow down the strum anyway. And all you're really doing is turning your fingers so you're still getting the tone, but it's kind of, kind of mutes it long enough that it gives it that bluesy fourth beat feel. That's how the strum goes all the way through the song. So practice those little techniques, those chords of that strum, and then join us for the song. This is called Going to Kansas City, Fats Domino Style. Hope you guys enjoy this one. Kansas 
city by the wine. Well, go to Kansas City, Kansas City, I come. Yeah, I'm going to Kansas City, Kansas City, I come. They got a lot of pretty women there. I'm going to get me one. Well, I might take a plane, might take a train. But if I gotta walk, I'm going just to say Kansas City, Kansas City, here I come. They got a lot of pretty women there. I'm gonna give me one. If I gotta walk, I'm gonna get there just the same Kansas City. Kansas City, here I come. They got a lot of free will left. I'm gonna get me one. Ah, that's a great old tune. I kind of put a spin on it there, giving a few little bluesy licks for you guys to kind of start playing some blues there and have some fun with it. So I hope you guys enjoyed that. Fats Domino a version of Kansas City. Uh, and uh, guys, get over to my channel. I got all kinds of fun things going on over there. We're getting into some blues now and doing some learner videos there so you guys can kind of, uh, you know, play around a lot. I think I've got a hundred and I think close to 200 videos anyway there. And they're all kind of simplified these songs a little bit. And you can play. You don't need to use all those licks that I did. You can actually just play the three chords there strum and sing those words and it'll be great. So uh, anyway, if you like what you see, definitely give me a like. I always like hearing from you guys. Lots of comments there. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. I put a new tune up every Thursday, so I hope to see you soon. Come visit me. Party Marty, Easy Guitar Tunes on YouTube. You take care now. Bye-bye.